Hello everyone and welcome back to The Outside Scoop. There are so many stories told by generations that are thought to be fake, but didn't you know some of them are actually true? So today we're going to be listing the 10 worldwide urban legends that are actually true. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload. At number 10 we have The Leaping Lawyer. Toronto residents hear the tale of a lawyer who had a peculiar fondness for running full bore into his office windows. This practice caught up with him eventually as he crashed into a window and went sailing to his death. This hobby actually practiced by Gary Hoy, a senior partner in an area law firm with an office on the 24th floor. Hoy made his signature tackle against the window to impress some visiting law students. The pain finally broke and sent him plummeting to his death. At number 9 we have Gators in the Sewers. This isn't a single urban legend, but you've no doubt heard of at least one cautionary tale about fully grown alligators lurking in city sewers. Some of the more outlandish legends claim that New York City, of all places, has a whole colony of alligators living beneath its streets. Police officers did pull a 2 foot long baby gator from a New York City sewer in 2010. At number 8 we have a killer who feeds victims to strangers. In 1995, Joe Matheny killed two people, chopped them up, mixed their meat in with pork, and sold them as pulled pork sandwiches. Joe's story sounds like the kind you hear in every small town, and knowing that it could really happen makes it even scarier. At number 7, we have the Polybius video game. The game was designed by the government to be a psychological experiment. It functioned like a drug, and it gave its players seizures and nightmares. Government officials would come in and extract information about the players through the arcade machine. At number 6 we have Charlie No Face. The legend had it that a figure with a severely burned face looked around an abandoned train tunnel at night. His name was Raymond Robinson and he had suffered a severe accident involving an electrical line that left him with a disfigured face. Because of this he became a bit of a recluse, staying inside during the day and only venturing out at night. At number 5 we have a woman in black seen walking across streets. In July 2014, people noticed a woman dressed in all black who was walking across the American Southeast and Midwest. At number 4 we have the Bunny Man. The unsubstantiated legend holds that in 1904 a bus crashed while transferring patients from an asylum in Fairfax County, Virginia. Shortly after the bus breakdown, dead bunnies started appearing around the area, many hanging from the Fairfax Station Bridge. Yikes! What is true is that in 1970, a pair of mysterious and scary incidents occurred in that area involving a man dressed in a bunny suit. At number 3 we have Cropsey of Staten Island. In some versions of the tale, Cropsey was an axe murderer. In others, he was a monstrous boogeyman. His name was Andre Rand, and he worked as a janitor at the Willowbrook State School before it shut down in 1987. Though this was never proven to be true, he was found guilty of kidnapping in 1988 and then again in 2004. At number 2 we have the dog boy. In 1954, a boy named J Gerald Bettis was born. The rumors around town held that he was cruel and sadistic and that he liked to capture stray animals and do twisted experiments on them. In 1981, his father was found dead in the family home and his death is surrounded in mystery. The newspaper said it was illness but many townspeople thought it was actually murder. At number 1 we have the Alice killings. A single playing card was found by each body with the word Alice written in the victim's blood. The truth is though that there was a serial killer who identified his murders with playing cards, but he operated in Spain, not Japan. Luckily this playing card killer was caught in 2003 and sentenced to 142 years in prison. That is our list for 10 worldwide urban legends that are actually true. If there was anything we missed in today's video, please tell us in the comments down below. Don't forget to like the videos, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload. Thanks for watching!